Hello, hello, hello! What's happening, everybody? MCOC Droid does back again for another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. It's a new month, it's a new event quest, so that means it is new Marvel Insider Bundles. We have a lot to talk about with this one, and I'm quite happy about it, so let's just get it right into it. So, you know, we got the usual message in-game the other day. Um, now through June 3rd, so through the end of the event quest, so you have plenty of time. You get the usual 10,000, 30,000, and 50,000 points respectively by doing the first completion of Beginner, Normal, and Heroic. Um, it does seem like they're, they're pretty much set with this. Um, in the past, sometimes they've had additional point opportunities when they've had special objectives. And the last couple of months that we've had special objectives, that has not popped up yet for, you know, an extra 10,000 points or whatever. So it looks like this will pretty much just stay as is, no matter what the month's content is, which, you know, it is what it is. It's fine. There are other ways of getting Marvel Insider points on a regular basis. So that's okay. But I did like it when they spiced it up a little bit. Um, you know, like tying it in with special objectives and giving you more points opportunities, etc., etc. So, yeah, the usual thing there, you know, you'll get your in-game mail. That's usually the surefire sign for you to go onto the Insider website. The link is down in the description below. And log in, go to the activities page, go to the respective event quest that you finished, put in your in-game name, and you are good to go. As always, I recommend people... If they plan on changing their name in game, do that first and then go online just so that you know that you have the most accurate up to date in game name that you're putting on the Marvel Insider website. That way you don't miss out on the points and you potentially don't miss out on the bundle. So yeah, just always be careful with that. Um, and so we have our two bundles this month per usual. You have the starter bundle and the the well, normally it's the questing bundle, but that's one of the things we have to talk about in a second. Um, let's just go over the the starter bundle first. We are, well, it's the usual 30,000 points. And we are gifted here with a two-star Black Widow Deadly Origin. So that is a rare two-star two champion. Great to see that back. Um, it's been a little few and far between for the most part. So it's good to see that you get the exclusive two-star again from this. Uh, you do also get a two-star Awakening Gem. There's no crystal there, so that means that it is a generic two-star Awakening Gem. So if absolutely necessary, you could awaken her right away. You also get the Premium Hero Crystal, so most likely you're just getting another two-star champion. Granted, there is the, the chance, the small chance, of getting a three-star or a four-star, but most likely you're just getting another... Uh, two-star champion so it is what it is and you'll also get five level two health potions and five level one revives always nice to pick up extra revives you get the five thousand gold as well and that's the usual thirty thousand that's kind of you know cookie cutter for something related to a, a usual monthly bundle and you do actually get one of the new champions as a two-star so that's a win right there but we have two bigger wins to talk about first and foremost uh, with the three, well, well, yeah, I'll just call it the three star bundle because I can't call it the questing bundle. Like I said, we'll get to that. But first of all, just the fact that this month there are two new champions and for the first time in a long time, both of the champions will be available for you here with Marvel Insider. Because as you can see, you do get the three-star Red Guardian here. And again, I, I, I'd really have to go back and dig deep. It has been a long, long time since both of the new champions for the month were featured. And even if you take out the months back when there used to be three champions in a month sometimes, and one of them would get left off, um, I still could not tell you the last time we had a month with all of the champions available in these insider bundles. It's great to see it again. Hopefully we'll keep seeing that, you know, I, I'm, I'm cautiously optimistic. I think it's the right phrase here, but, uh, it's great to see it here. Uh, so thank you for that Marvel. Please keep it up. We like the champions to be in these bundles, especially the exclusive two stars. You know, we love those starter bundles to give us a chance at a two star. We, we might not normally ever get in the game. Um, so that is really cool. Glad to see that. The other big thing, as I've now mentioned a couple of times and you've already seen, um, this is not a questing bundle. For the first time, this is an incursion bundle. They are really pushing this. Um, you know, obviously it's only been out for a short time, but it's it's 
much more popular than dungeons ever were. Maybe that's not a hundred percent true statement, but it seems pretty safe to say that incursions are a lot more fun. Um, it is still a bit of a grind, but it, it just seems like, yeah, it's more accessible. It's more fun than dungeons ever were. So to see a bundle already featured like this, um, revolving around incursions is uh, one, just a nice change of pace. I've mentioned in videos before, I wish they would, you know, change up the rewards a bit, um, change up the points opportunities as well. So, so to see a bundle that is nothing like we've seen before, totally revolving around incursions is very nice. If you don't run incursions, this probably won't be as exciting for you. So if you like, you could totally skip this. But this is a lot of stuff in here. So as you can see, again, you do get the three-star Red Guardian, which is great. You get 2,000 incursion artifacts. Not a huge amount. Um, you know, for somebody like me, if we go out here, um, I am in the top tier in terms of incursions. Like, I, I have the maximum amount of champs for the reward. So I'm in tier one, as you can see right there. You need at least 16 uh, five star champions to be in the top tier right there and you know it, it goes down based on uh, however many you have and then it goes down to four stars and what have you and three stars etc etc so I'm in the top tier so I have the top uh, rewards bracket if you if you want to call it that um, and so looking at milestones you know these do refresh every five days and it looks like I need to get on it for this rotation but but for me every five days I'm getting I would get a maximum of 3300 dungeon or, uh, excuse me see see look I gotta I keep tripping up I gotta keep thinking incursion incursion um, so every five days I can get a possibility of 3300 incursion artifacts so 2000 is not a huge amount and again if we oh, get out of this um, if we look over in the the tab the the crystals tab for incursions um, on its own there's not a huge amount you can do like you can see even here some of the specific three star crystals the ones that have a specific set of champions in them are 3,000 artifacts. So the 2,000 won't even get you that. It may get you a... Okay, so there you go. So it does get you a guaranteed three-star crystal. So even if you don't run incursions at all, you can pick up this bundle. You'll get your three-star Red Guardian. You'll get the other items, which I'll talk about in a second, which may not do anything for you. They'll just sit in your inventory for forever. But at an absolute minimum, you can also pull another three-star crystal, and then you don't even have to think about it anymore if you don't want. But... Um, otherwise, it'll just get you closer to your next three-star, four-star, five-star crystal, whatever you want to do for these. Um, so, you know, any and all dungeon artifacts are certainly worth it. Um, and I just said it again. Incursion artifacts. Incursion, incursion, incursion. I just need to keep saying incursion, apparently. Uh, but you get my drift. All of the artifacts are always appreciated to pick up. Um, so then on top of that, if let's just look at the items first. So you get two level two incursion revives five each of the level two and level three incursion potions and you also get five of the greater golden crystals um so again let's look at this so you get five level two potions five level three potions and two level two revives so let me pull that back away actually let's get that off screen let's go back into the tab for incursions not dungeons see i got it right um let's go back here and so you get two of the level two incursion revives. They're 52 units each. So that's 104 units right there um, in terms of the worth of the items. And then not the team potions, but the, the solo potions. So you get five of the level twos and five of the level threes. So a set of those combined, as you can see, that's 14 and 29 units. So that's 43 units. Multiply that by five and that's 215 units worth. So 215 plus another 104, that's almost, well, that's well over 300 units. Um, and if we take a look at the unit packages, not all of these cards that are being offered today, or these other special bundles that popped up for whatever reason, um, that's more than $10. I, I just wanted to put that there as a means of um, correlating the, the units worth to the actual unit packs. So for here, for American dollars, uh, 10 bucks gets you 275 units. These items are worth more than that. So not only are you getting a three-star new champion with Red Guardian, 
not only are you getting again if you wanted to you could just spend those incursion artifacts on a just a random three star crystal if you wanted to not only are you getting a little bit of gold from the five greater golden crystals but then you're getting over 300 units worth of items that if you are running incursions that's going to help a bunch that may help you to get to a higher zone um that maybe you're not normally comfortable with running but again since there's no penalty for for continuing to progress further you've got these extra items on hand you can save units might as well give it a try see how far you can push yourself so that hopefully you are getting uh deeper into the incursions you are earning more of those milestones you know like it's this is a really i'll put it back up again this is a really good bundle it's probably one of the better ones that we've seen in quite a long time um and yes, it is mostly revolved around incursions, so if you don't do them regularly, you may feel a little left out. But I still think pretty much if you're a fan of Marvel Insider, you should be getting this bundle, period, end of sentence. Um, again, great to get the three-star Red Guardian, you know, saves you the arena grind or potentially going for him in crystals. Uh, yeah, this is this is this has just been the best month for Marvel Insider in a very, very long time. So, yeah, and I'll, I'll throw this one up here, too, just in case you need to uh, reference this yourself again. But this is a great month. So thank you for this, Marvel. Um, I really am glad that you got, first and foremost, both champions represented in these bundles. Thank you for that. Um, we need to see that more often. We definitely need to see that more often. So please keep that up as much as you possibly can. Keep these bundles fresh. Keep these bundles exciting. And yeah, like I said, be sure to get them this month because they're quite good. That'll wrap it up. Let me know in the comments below if you are indeed getting both bundles and uh, what are you excited for? Are you going to save those incursion artifacts? I had to do that one more time just to make sure I got it right. Um, what are you going to save up those incursion artifacts for? Let me know in the comments below. Hit that like button. Hit subscribe. Ring that bell. Be sure to turn on all notifications so you get notified of all of my Marvel Insider and the rest of the MCOC content coming at you every single day. For now, though, thank you so much for watching. Take care, and I will see you next time.